Much to a lot of people's disappointment, 6ix9ine is the man of the moment once again. He is simply the one rapper that many people hate, but can't ignore. We all know how annoying those people are. We hate them for many reasons, but we just continue to give them attention. Because of his attitude, the 24-year-old has picked up quite a number of enemies in the last few years. He doesn't shy away from any beef. In fact, he often goes out of his way to look for trouble. In winning a beef, 6ix9ine is the kind of person that would do anything to embarrass his opponent. In this video, we'll look at the moments 6ix9ine has completely embarrassed other rappers. Before we dive into this list, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you're a fan of 6ix9ine, and if you would like to join this month's giveaway of a brand new iPhone 11, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck! Number 10. First up is 50 Cent. That he embarrassed 50 Cent is both surprising and not surprising. It is surprising because both artists have had a father-son relationship in the past, but it's not surprising because both 50 Cent and 6ix9ine are always looking for trouble. It was only a matter of time before they turned on each other. Recently, when 50 Cent said he wouldn't like to work with 6ix9ine in the future, 6ix9ine responded and said, won't be the first time 50 abandons his son, let me just mind my business. To be honest, that comment was a knockout. Number 9. The Game No one is really sure of when it started, but they have dragged themselves through the mud a couple of times. The most notorious and vicious attempt going to 6ix9ine. After the game accused 6ix9ine of being a fake blood, 6ix9ine took to his Instagram to establish the fact that he's been a gang member since he was a kid. He then posted an embarrassing video of the game, appearing in a dating show when he was 21, about 40 years ago. Just kidding. While on the dating show, the game got played, and the video of the heartbroken Compton rapper never gets old. Number 8. Snoop Dogg Snoop Dogg is that neighborhood father that everyone loves because he's cool and unproblematic. The problem with Snoop Dogg and 6ix9ine started after he snitched. Snoop Dogg is cool, but he is still old school. He's never going to be friendly with a snitch. Well, in a couple of months, Snoop Dogg may actually wish he'd been friendly with 6ix9ine because the rat is going after his family. When Snoop Dogg posted a picture of him and his wife on Instagram, 6ix9ine posted a comment under the post, saying, Didn't you cheat on her a couple of months ago with at Selena A. Powell XO? She deserves better. Number 7. Meek Mill Let's be honest, Meek Mill has made it his sole life purpose to end and discredit 6ix9ine. Like Snoop Dogg, Meek Mill doesn't forgive snitches either. Unlike the case with other artists, 6ix9ine has been gentle with Meek Mill. He hasn't had a lot to say about him. However, when the opportunity presented itself, he dragged Meek Mill through the mud. In an Instagram video, he said Meek Mill is only angry because, despite the fact that he was in jail for 18 months, he's still doing more numbers than him. 6ix9ine's comment was a strong blow. Even though Meek Mill has attempted a comeback, it didn't stop the embarrassing comments 6ix9ine made. Number 6. Rich the Kid The beef between the two started in May 2020, when Rich the Kid was reported to be owing $20,000 to a jeweler. Both rappers have been having endless back and forth since, but 6ix9ine has served the heaviest blows. A few weeks after the debt report became public, Rich the Kid posted a picture of himself landing in New York. He captioned it, The King is Home. His caption is a response to 6ix9ine, calling himself the King of New York. Rick's caption was seen as a dig at 6ix9ine. However, 6ix9ine responded almost immediately with a comment that would have completely embarrassed Rich the Kid. He said, he's running from his debt in LA, I'm about to call 911. It was a good response, but let's hope no one uses it against him in the future. Snitches are never forgotten. Number 5. Rich the Kid, again. In the height of his beef with Rich the Kid, 6ix9ine asked all his followers to unfollow him. And guess what? They did. Rich the Kid started losing followers immediately. It becomes more embarrassing for Rich the Kid because he was almost begging to get to 8 million followers. He even promised to drop a song if he gets to 8 million. He was making steady progress towards 8 million when 6ix9ine chimed in and asked people to start unfollowing him. Rich the Kid obviously doesn't have enough social media clout as 6ix9ine, and he proved it. Number 4. Lil TJ The beef between Lil TJ and 6ix9ine dates back to the months before his incarceration. When 6ix9ine came out of jail, Lil TJ criticized those still associating with 6ix9ine. Lil TJ said 6ix9ine is a rat and not the king of New York. In response, 6ix9ine said, For the king of New York shit, let's cut that out. Lil boy sit down, I ain't beefing with anyone from New York. If you don't gotta watch this right here, you're little boy to me. I'll kiss your forehead. Number 3. Chief Keef 6ix9ine has proven over and over that he would do anything to troll rappers who dare get in a beef with him. In 2018, while he still had a hot beef with Chief Keef, 6ix9ine took one of his baby mamas on a shopping spree. 
He spent $75,000 on her, buying her all sorts of expensive outfits and jewelry. 6 9 appeared on camera telling Chief Keef that if he doesn't know how to take care of his girl, someone else will. Number 2. This is a recent one, and they aren't really rappers, but it's worth mentioning. He had no public relationship with Ariana Grande and Justin Bieber before he was locked up, but there's no chance of him having any collaboration with these two stars anymore. Not after he publicly accused them of buying their way to the number one spot on Billboard chart. 6 9 called out Ariana Grande, Justin Bieber, and Billboard, and accused them of conniving to rig the chart. He said Grande and Bieber used six different credit cards to buy their way to the top. Even though all the parties involved have denied any foul play, it takes some nerve to embarrass two top artists like that and then drag Billboard into it. Number 1. Trippy Red We've saved the best for last. Trippy Red and 6 9 have been attacking each other for some years now, and there have been many blows thrown between them. The peak of it, however, was when 6 9 shared a video of him and Trippy Red's ex-girlfriend, Alex, in bed together. With that move, he showed everyone that he could get whomever he wants. There was some recent controversy to this after an online back and forth happened between 6 9 and Alex where she exposed that it was a video for show and nothing actually happened between them. 6 9 had a different side of the story, but either way that goes, it was never a good look for Trippy Red. Even though 6 9 may not be the most talented rapper for his abilities on the mic, he is certainly establishing himself as the undisputed king of controversy and trolling. We may very well see him go down in history as the social media king troll. With that, we end today's video. Which of these situations do you think 6 9 was the most savage with? Let us know your opinions down in the comments. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you're a fan of 6 9 And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Mixed Dice Media. See you in the next one.